So what are the signs and symptoms of heart failure? So we talked about you could either have a problem with relaxation or you can have a problem with pumping. But the net effect is the same, like you mentioned, is you get congestion in the lungs and the, in the body. So let's go through this. You'll be restless. Obviously, you have a lot of fluid buildup, so you're going to be anxious. You might have some confusion. Why is that? Because your heart, if it's not pumping adequately, you might make good blood flow to the, to the brain. Orthopnea basically means that at night, you'll be sleeping with extra pillows at night. You can't lie flat, because when you lie flat, you get more congestion in the heart. So a lot of our patients say they can't sleep flat at night. They need to use pillows or sleep in a chair. Exertional dyspnea, they, when they walk, they get shortness of breath with limited distances. Fatigue could be a sign that the heart is very weak. And then as a result of congestion in the lungs, they'll have a cough. Usually it's a dry cough. It's worse at night. They might have some signs on exam when we listen to them with, their, with the stethoscope. They might have crackles, which is a certain sound we listen to, which represents fluid in the lungs. And their respiratory rate might be elevated. And something called proximal nocturnal dyspnea. This basically means that patients will wake up at night kind of gasping for air. Sometimes they'll say they need to go to a window to catch their breath. This is all a sign that they have a lot of congestion in the lungs and signs for heart failure. 